Hi there, solar panel enthusiasts. Today we're going to be taking a look at GoPower's MC4 solar panel extension cables. These extension cables have both a male and a female end on them, one on each end. And this is a standard MC4 connector right here. And this is what you're going to find on a lot of your solar panel systems. And if you have a solar prep package, you'll find something like this on your roof. And right there is a MC4 connector. Most of your solar preps are going to have MC4 connections here on top. And each one of these is going to be different. This one here you can see is the male. I've already got the one over here plugged into the female. But you can see this is what the female would look like here. Because I've got the cable end, female end right here. And the cables can't be any easier to, to operate. You can't really get them wrong because they're always going to be male and female to the point to where you can't plug stuff in backwards. The positive and negatives being the different shapes like this are going to ensure that you can never plug in uh, things incorrectly. So that's really nice to set. It makes the installation extremely easy and straightforward since your connectors, when you get to the other end, it's going to be obvious which one that has to plug into. Now these cables do come in varying lengths. We're using the 10 foot, but they're also available in a 3 foot, 15 foot, 30 and 50 foot, just depending on how long the a run you need to make from your connection point to wherever your solar panels are. And depending on your layout, you may need some shorter extensions to get your solar panels to connect together. We got lucky on this particular unit that we were able to put two solar panels right next to each other. So we didn't need any extension cables to get those two panels connected together, but we did need the extensions to get them to our rooftop connection point. The cables have a nice thick sheathing on them that's going to protect it against the elements. And it, it kind of has a nice weight to it that helps keep it down on your roof. We do secure it wherever we can, but uh, if you're going on a very long run, you may not be able to secure it every so many feet or whatever. And then the weight kind of helps keep it in place for you. It's a very nice taut uh, sheathing on it. Inside of the sheathing, you're going to have a 10 gauge wire, which is going to be ample to power the solar controller and trickle that energy that we're harnessing from the sun down inside to charge our batteries. So here on my right you can see the solar array that we installed and we got lucky that those two panels could fit right next to one another. But if the, we wanted to upgrade and add more in the future, maybe we wanted to add another one, we could put it over here on this side, but we would need an extension cable to have it run over to connect in with this and then we already got our existing extensions which run back to the connector. And we can add as many panels as our solar controller can handle. This particular unit that we installed here is a 30 amp unit. So the two panels we've got here don't quite add up to 20 collectively. So we could easily add a third panel without having to worry about it. And if we wanted to go to more panels, we may have to consider upgrading our controller. But you can clearly see here the various things we've got on our roof. And if we wanted to add panels in other locations, we would need to have these extensions to be able to reach to all those different spots. So when you're planning out a solar install, I do highly recommend that you figure out where you're going to be placing your units so you can order the right extension cables so that way once you get everything mounted up you don't come to find that oh darn I don't have what I need to get everything connected. These extensions work extremely quick and easy because they just plug in on each side and with the varying length you can have a nice clean layout up on your roof. And that completes our look at GoPower's MC4 solar panel extension cables.